global Himalayan expedition has installed over 250 microgrids in outlying areas of Ladakh. After Hanamore, we visited one specifically designed to light up the minds of school children. Thank you very much. Halsey, travel residential hostel. Thank you. Yeah. It's at the government higher secondary school in Kalse. Hello, kids. Hello. Hello. So they've got an innovative computer system and what I'm going to do is I'm going to test it by asking you a few simple questions. So I'm going to write them on the board and then you fire up the computers and we'll get to work. Okay, sir. Okay. Right, so here we go. Who was Atahualpa? What are Brussels sprouts? And when did Babo come to India? That's right. So get to work. <laughs> It might look like they're online, but they're actually scouring through an offline internet. So even without a data connection, these children will learn the sort of research skills essential for finding out information in a connected world. And of course, it all runs off solar power. There's half a terabyte of memory in here, and installed on here is all of Wikipedia, TED Talks, all sorts of other encyclopedias, all sorts of works works that the kids can use in order to research all sorts of subjects. So that's the heart of the system. But this is the key to keeping it all low power. This is a Raspberry Pi UK developed computer system, incredibly low energy, drives the keyboard and the mouse. So this is the computer that they use. Now what it means is they can have up to 10 of these bright LED screens all running on 24 volts. So very, very, very efficient. Okay, everybody, time's up. We need some answers. I'm going to come down the line and I'm going to pick on you. So who is Atahualpa? Atahualpa is the last king of Inca Empire. Excellent. Very good. So tell me, what do you think of this system? How does it work? It works very really well and I gain many knowledge from it. Uh, it's uh, very useful. It's uh, really easy to operate. Um, I think it's perfect for, for a pass for a student uh, of uh, mountain areas. 